the Schubert Quintet for two cellos is really a canonical piece. One of the most sublime monuments, not only the chamber music repertoire, but I would say the classical music repertoire, period. There's great turbulence in it. There's great sadness in it. But there's also great joy in it. So it's a piece that's a bit like life. It's, it's got a bit of everything in it. As we've been rehearsing the Schubert Quintet, it feels like one of those all-star baseball teams where you put together some of your favorite players from different teams and also from different generations. Playing first violin, my Emerson Quartet colleague, Philip Setzer. Playing second violin, Tessa Lark, who's a regular guest and favorite at the festival. The linchpin of the whole group, the violist, Xin Yun Huang, who is in the Borromeo Quartet. Myself playing cello, and the marvelous cellist, a, a real musician hero of mine, Peter Wiley, who was the former cellist of the Beaux-Arts Trio and of the Guarneri String Quartet. The Schubert Quintet, commonly referred to as the Schubert Two Cello Quintet, will always remain a significant part of my life. And I would believe that most string players have had a significant experience with the piece. I distinctly remember the first time I played in public with the Emerson String Quartet was when David Finkel was still officially their cellist. It was his last concert, and he played the first half of that concert, and then we programmed the Schubert Quintet for the second half, and I came on stage and joined as the second cellist, and also perhaps as the cellist-in-waiting of the Emerson Quartet. So it was a literal turning point. What was fascinating for me was that, in many ways, Pete Wiley had a very similar trajectory to me. You know, he came in to play the last nine or ten years with the Guarneri Quartet, replacing its longtime cellist, David Sawyer. Our paths are remarkably similar. similar. Yeah. Maury was talking about it the other night. And yeah. In addition, that we were both in these quartets, right. these wonderful quartets for about the, for same the last ten, of time. nine yeah. or ten years, yeah. Look at that. It's interesting, it's exactly the same amount of time. It, I know, yeah, but yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the, the PWs. I guess it would have been in the spring of 2000 when I was honored to be invited to join the Guarneri Quartet and take my teacher's chair. He said, I'm, I'm leaving the quartet and the boys want to play with you. My knees started shaking, literally. Wow. And I, we had a bit of a conversation. I basically said, well, no, I don't think so, but you know, let's talk. And that's how it started. And yeah. Three months from that point, I said, yeah, okay. it was pretty soon. They had a Carnegie Hall concert scheduled, and because I had been announced to join the quartet, they put the Schubert on the program with me as the second cellist to play with these four guys who were my teachers and my mentors. That was a kind of a turning point for the Guarneri Quartet and one of the most significant turning points of my musical life. Wow, wow it's right. Oh, it's cool. Oh, 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 I love playing with oh, you. Oh, and that's you. Oh, you so How about that? Yeah, <laughs> <I> know, <laughs> and you. Oh, my God. How long has it been? Too long. Oh, God, too like 30 long. years, 40 it's years. Like, it's like it. Nearly 35 Thank you. years. 35 this is why years I came to like Detroit. Long time. I came oh, here to play with oh. Paul <laughs> and to play with Pete. I mean, cool. I've been it's looking. No, it's, it's All right. As we've been rehearsing the Sugar Pig the last few days, <laughs> yeah. it's been really exciting to, to witness that cross pollination of, of, of traditions and ideas. To be here and play with these colleagues. Uh, just been filled with more and more gratitude as the years have gone by. The music that we know just gets better. The more you search, the more you find. And what we do as musicians is all about the search. It's, it's a journey well worth taking. <laughs>